I'm gonna have to sacrifice the gray dreadnought or whatever. The dread knight. There you go. Do you just want uh, one of those Indominus? No, I need to sacrifice the dread knight to summon Kaldor Drago. You're not summoning Kaldor. Oh my god. Why not? He, we need his help. He doesn't need to go. We need to summon him because Magnus is being all uppity again. Oh my god. Anyway, what I learned is turn up 28. I had to look this up after, well, learning about this thing existing. It's a war game about uh, mutated Europe. Where there's this giant tree of, or giant roots that have mutated the land and the people. I think it's an Eldritch Never. thing, but yeah. Never common. The Dread Knight is, is babies. Oh my god. You just sacrifice it. Experiment one off. Honestly, I hope they make more videos like this if they can. You ready? Enjoy our parish fable. Once upon a time, in a land too close for comfort, there was a king, or so he would have it believed. That title was, in truth, self-proclaimed, and even the people he supposedly ruled over had hardly any respect for him. Knerg Carola, as he was known of the 131st Anders Mash Footstuber. Where do you think so far, Fable? Um, well, we have a self-proclaimed king, and I'm not really sure what those models are. Uh, they're, they they're assume for... the king is like some kind of weird baboon man. He's a boar. Yeah. He's a boar. Yes. There's a regiment of ranked amateurs weird. and cannibals with a constant yearning for mash in all its forms. The one claim to fame yeah. is an old fortress they managed to pilfer and guard as their own upon a small yeah. molehill. One they now call Anders Mountain, after the alleged god Anders whom cracked its head on a rock. <laughs> One pestilent afternoon, another foul regiment, right. the 71st Flogister Hagbaby, suddenly stood outside the castle walls, hollering something to the would-be king. Oh, he is a boy. Yeah. Remove the fort! Where was that? Remove the fort! Remove the fort! Never. 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 Well, they want to remove the fort because it's apparently in their way. It's the principle of the thing, Fable. But, but it's so true, they can just walk around it. It's the principle of the my thing. Inside, my of your cauldron water will drive plagues and through my land. Oh my god. So be good for the ligament swine. It seems we are at an impasse. Yes. Good thing I brought this fucking elephant. Uh... <laughs> 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 yeah. Children of the nation, to your station. And so, after the pettiest possible disagreement, the war would begin. I mean, he's not wrong. Over the petty po most possible agreement. I see no flaw. In the the hag babies. Yeah, the Flagister Hag Babies versus the Ender's Mesh Foots Tubers. The cult of Brotherhood of Greed versus the cult of the March of the Probuscus. Probuscus. There's a lot of mutants and not the nice kind like the X-Men. Yeah, these are not the like great them. Probuscus and the great knight Brilgos the Jackalope Knight. Sir Knight, we must 
must break through this wall. It's our only home. We could sit the night. We stoop to be the equals of scales. Would we model ourselves after the flat-headed worm? Would we curve our spines in meek submission before all in our path? No! Our path shall be straight. Straight to Lady Norella's saloon. For great care, <laughs> For we are worthy. We are worthy. Oh my now, god. Humans ask to deny your plan. How well can <laughs> Oh my god. They just want to go so low, but I'm so confused. Uh, apparently, there's a salon. They want to go to get a uh, hair care, and the Ford is in the way. They could walk around it. Apparently, it's the principle of the thing. Say so they said that they would be the equals of snails if On they the did other not side fight. Of the wall, the soldiery took their position. The grievously crippled Grubhub Toady of the King was called upon to take action and begin the fight on his front. Oh yeah. I welcome to hell, words hell boys, I like the order. I'm so hungry. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Father, please attack. Attack who? Attack. <laughs> attack. Attack. Who? Who? Close Oh, Father Yud activates gluttony. Oh! The lethargic grub hub, not able to make any sensical strategical pronouncements, had the father stop ripping each other apart and consuming the flesh of the previous brothers in arms with insane vigor. And oh, they're eating each other. Until only one individual stood Mushroom Man. Eleven models Mushroom removed. Mushroom Man. Yes. yes. I am better than <laughs> the only name. Yes, that is Mushroom Man. They are but candles to be blown out. And so the Mushroom Man, last of his brotherhood, held aloft his musket gun and suddenly laid upon the enemy oh, father poor. like a gatling gun. 48 times. Oh, dear God. Oh. Foul gorilla magic. What in the hell is this madness? This man is the son of God. I don't blasphemous shame you. Only what this burn. I mean, yeah. Stoop cannon volley fire. Swine riders. The cannon was prepared and the war continued. Believe it or not, it was swines could be really fast. Principles with no one willing to back down, and so it went on with the fate of the fortress hanging in the balance. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Fat bird formation. Fat commands the bastards to charge the elephants. The bastards try to do so, but fail, fail. They rope two words, fail, fail, fail. Oh, dear. <laughs> bastards gets his fingernail caught in a tank trap and dies immediately. The rest mourn his loss and do not move another inch. The fools dare sally forth from their funny little castle. Will not prevent them. Very well, by the will of God. By the will of God. The evil fucking elephant charges, <laughs> losing its bowels to get an extra speed boost. The bastard yes, that's an actual move, move, apparently, that it has. I'm are confused. What universe is this? I said oh, it's turn up 28. Meek 
Bastards are caught. <laughs> Pretty turn up 28. A very weird mutant the land of Europe. In it takes place apparently during the Napoleonic Wars. Started Europe. We talked about this. It's <laughs> back. Knowing he no longer has anything to lose and inflicts two wounds. Out of eight! The elephant has won. All know this. And experiencing a sudden fit of primal panic, the remaining bastard suddenly retreats, compelled by his death anxiety, leaving his knag behind. I'm being fistulous! Oh. Hey, 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 hey! Why the I was a drunk mountain on my kitchen wall! The oh Khmer, dear. Using his immensely powerful voice, once again commands the bastard to return to the fray. The bastard charges the final charge of his life and attacks limply. Oh. The elephant only takes one wound, and oh. there's five wounds remaining. The bastard oh dear. joins his kin in the mass grave. Damn. Oh. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. Shoot or something. <laughs> I feel like I'm about to fade. The <laughs> <I'm> about <laughs> mushroom to man. The mushroom man fable. <laughs> mushroom man. Oh. He shoots and misses. Bracing himself. Oh my god, the god. Takes on the bulk uh, of the elephant's charge. But being severely wounded, no Corolla struggles as his blow His name is Corolla. The elephant's slick skin. The Knirg in turn slides off in retreat. The brutes stand fast behind the safety of the walls, unwilling to rescue the Knirg from the onslaught of the elephant. Should we save that guy? <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, <laughs> I love that. Fails the hawks as part of the wall crumbles and collapses under their feet. Grubhub, the toady, and Mushroom Man fall to the ground. Grubhub's already withered ankles shatter from the impact, but it matters not, for this fall has once more galvanized the resolve oh. of the new Son of Man. That fall made my blood sugar spike back up. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> the cannon oh, turns towards the Knurg himself. Firing a volley of grape shot at the Knurg, the cannon inflicts a final wound to the Knurg and turns him into a fine mist. <laughs> oh boy. For the next step yeah. in our plan. The elephant, still on the loose, despite the fact that the hag is at this stage probably just go unharmed. <laughs> <laughs> they could probably just go unharmed, but they still keep attacking. Enraged by the visage of a mushroom it next to it, yeah. and been fed not but death caps for the last five years, is compelled to charge. Oh, as easy as the closest target. The other plant attacks with its full power. Twelve massive stops, kicks, and trunkadunks. Yet, out of the twelve maximum attacks, only two manage to hit. Wow. The mushroom man defies his vulnerability role and gets double sixes. So oh boy. The onslaught against all odds. Dear God. Father retaliates, summoning all his mycelial might. Mycelial might. Misses. Neither combatant has caused any wounds to the other, and so the melee continues. The elephant attacks again six times, and the mushroom man realizes the battle is futile. This world is already gone. What he fights for was already lost the day he took up arms. Salvation cannot come through this folly. Oh dear. That's actually pretty sad. The catharsis of death. The elephant gets four hits and mushroom oh. is fucking bound to death. Oh poor mushroom. Ew elephant. Ew. The lone grubhub 
plucked in place, seeing the very death of the empire he helped build. Now, what do you think so far, Fable? On the horizon. I'm confused. Can do not but fire his small I am just very confused. I don't understand this madness. Like he misses much like he misses his late, late wife. Bounds towards him. <laughs> the great Proboscis approaches, stomping forth like doomsday itself. Me to no fable, yeah. All. And it fails its dangerous terrain test and steps on a rusty nail, losing its last remaining wound and dies. The elephant's dead, fable. Grub hop. Lives. Probably for the best. <laughs> the Hag Babies lost this skirmish. The greatest weapon felled, and the Lady Gnorella Saloon closing the battle. The first confused by this episode. Bitterly contemplating her lack of hair care. Sore loser. <laughs> the Anders Mash Footstubers would remain within the fort under the new leadership of Knurg Grub Hub, whose ankles would never mm. heal. <laughs> so, how you like it so far, Fable? Knurg Corolla's remains would be scooped I... up and put into the great mm. stew. I don't know. <laughs> the knight Brilgos would flagellate himself and start a church in dedication to the Mushroom Man, who oh, he was boy. convinced died for the redemption of the folly of man. Well, the parish now consists of four people, all <laughs> of which have tuberculosis. The end. Tuberculosis. Good night, everyone. I don't even know. I hate it by sharing discussion and confusion. <laughs> Well, I, I hope you... To my understanding, this is... Was this an actual campaign they had, or was this just a weird summary video someone thought and said, I let's think... just be stupid and see how this goes? Well, it's right here. It says, the rules are free. It's a really good tabletop game. Please play it. It please, please. Not sponsored, by the way. No. We just like the game. No, I don't want to. <laughs> you don't want to play uh, Turn Up 28? Yeah. I, I mean, I would if I had an understanding about, I mean, not just the rules, but what the... So they destroyed a fort or failed to destroy a fort because they wanted to go to a salon, but instead of actually doing the reasonable thing, they just thought, let's kill Mushroom Man and, and, and destroy the fort because it's the principle of the thing. Pretty much, and they lost because their jack the rest of their soldiers lost morale because their giant elephant was killed. Yeah, no, I, I, I'll be honest, I feel like this is something that was made when they were either drunk or high off as a kite. Forgive me, YouTube, but it just it just seems like one of those things you do when you're, you know, under the influence of something. Probably. Or anyway, really bored. Thank you all so much, and we'll see you guys next time. Uh, maybe Fable will be less confused the next video we watch. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Listen, I'm not trying to be rude, it's just... I, I could not follow the plot after the fact that apparently they wanted to destroy a fort because they didn't want to go on the side. I think it was a Monty um, Python reference. Of course, it's a Monty Python reference. It's the principle of the thing, Fable. Oh. Anyway, thank you all so much. Check out our pa check out my Patreon if you want, and think about subscribing and liking if you like our stuff. And if you want more, definitely do all that stuff. If it's a Monty Python reference. How come? How come the Black Light, the Black Knight, didn't lose an arm and said it's just a flesh wound? I mean, technically, that's what happened with the Mushroom Man. Anyway, see you guys later. Jeez, what a scratch.